Hello everyone. Um, this video is totally not what I expected my next video to be about. But it's just an amazing shout out to uh, another modeler, um, Bob, whose channel over there is Stig800. Um, he, he contacted me a little while ago about sending me up a few 3D parts. And I received a parcel this morning that the, the postman just struggled to carry. And I thought, what is in there? I, I do not remember ordering a new new sewing machine. And it was this parcel from Stig. Inside it, as you can see, are these um, three cars. Uh, an Eclat Corvette there in a sort of gunmetal bronzy uh, colour. Um, this Trans Am. There's a Trans Am on it, Firebird Trans Am. Yeah, that's right. That's a Pontiac Trans Am in a, a skull, uh, you know, a masked skull paint job o over a, a really lovely metallic red, wine red colour. A Plymouth that's um, lent up in the corner there. And the, 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 the contents of the box I still haven't got to yet, as they were some 3D parts. So I thought I'll carry on rummaging through the box. And just have a quick glance over this here Pontiac that he'd made. And it's now got bored with. I, I suppose, I don't know how he expects me to actually tear this apart and say, oh, brilliant, I'll use it for scrap. It's just, it's, um, how can you scrap it? Ding, lovely bit of paint. And this Eclat Corvette, I mean, it's got all the, all the body kit on it. Nice set of wheels. I mean, this is closer for me to scrapping, but there's a well sought after body. Amazing. And like I said, that isn't all of it. Um, oh, my arm isn't long enough. This Plymouth as well. This is uh, the uh, sort of snap together one, of, well, screw it together. Um, but still, it's a great donor for wheels. And I sawed one of these up the, uh, a while back for, just for the bonnet. Um, hood and it's got a tasty back end as well for messing around with uh, sort of doing I mean why wasn't there a coupe of this three window coupe hmm might be one day or the back end can go on to the back end of a three window coupe um, so that's partially it and not like I said, not even got to what I was getting to, or expecting. Ah, oh, wow. There was, if I can get this out. Also included. Was this. A nearly complete. Let's hope I don't knock you over, Stig. Ah, pickup truck, jet ski, well, wave rider you call them, and a trailer. And there's only a few parts missing and the decals missing from it. And I think, um, no, no, everything else was in there. Wheels, tyres, I'm trying to find a square to put stuff out the way. Which is, is phenomenal. I don't know how much one of these goes for. But, um, crew cab, this might make a good donor for the uh, Bedford that I was, um, if anyone saw the 3D printed Bedford I got recently. So apart from that, and I still haven't got to the 3D parts, very nice box, isn't it? Those who, who like their Johan kits, you could say, guess what colour this, this one's in? 
but it doesn't actually contain, contain that either. What is in here is an artillery. I'll lift that out. Rolls Royce. And I thought, my word. And uh, when I was looking at it earlier, I thought, it's got such lovely lights on it really has got neat headlamps and uh, spotlights and that but then when I was doing this the top dropped down and I thought oh it looks much better with a rooftop we're getting ant hill mob there I can have them all with their feet running out the bottom so I don't know what to do with that yet Apart from possibly steal all the lights off of it, do something with a big engine, big straight six Rolls Royce. And I still haven't got to the 3D parts. This is amazing, isn't it? I don't know about you, but I, I, I'm just blown away. I, I, I am still blown away. But then finally, This El Camino comes chugging into the picture with a loaded pickup bed. He sent this El Camino as well. <laughs> and in such a fantastic turquoisey, bluey, whatever the hell that colour is, but it's fantastic. I absolutely adore this colour. Um Big old wheels on there. And I noticed he's added some big boom pipe uh, tips on the end there. And it's included some 3D parts that he's made. After all of that, that including the, the, the stick figure in the background there, Sent me all that stuff, and I think that's absolutely mind-blowingly incredible. And I can't thank you enough, Bob. I, I think that's just awesome. There are some fantastically fine fans in here. And I hope this will come through. Maybe if I put a bit of paper behind them rather than just my hand. I don't do anything. Fans. Oops. I'm a great fan now. Um, some more of them. Maybe they were better on the hand there. Oh, come on, thing. Um, some speakers. Base bin speakers, that'd be great for a low rider clan I have. <coughs> Some lovely batteries. Some turbos, there's a... Uh, look at that. Oh, that. I hope that will see down that hole. There is fan detail down that hole. Uh, wow. And there is some really nice detail on these. And some more. For, for the, I, I'm just amazed. He's uh, done a fantastic job at... Mm, come on, focus for me. At printing these, there's no stub marks on them or any, you know, just brilliantly done ones. So what a collection of stuff! I'm just blown away by it all. Um, can't thank him enough. You know, there's just a wave rider kit. Um, you know, with a Silverado in there. 
pushing out the way stick. Here I love our nation. Thank you very much. Um, I hope you are. If you're not signed up to Stig, go and visit him. He actually does do some brilliant models. He's recently done a, a really great truck, um, a 3D resin truck kit with a mid-engine, supercharged mid-engine. I think it's blown anyway. But fantastic and, and great builder. He's been in, in on YouTube for a, a fair while now and... You know, is a great supporter of a lot of people. Um, that's it for me. Thank you. For, I'm still just gobsmacked by it all. So thank you very much, and uh, best wishes from jolly old England.